today I'm going to do a, another video, sort of like my last one. Don't go away, I'm talking about different things today, I swear. <laughs> it's not about poop again. I really need to make a poop video. I apologize. God, what is wrong with me? Every time my brain thinks of a thing that I think is worthy of talking to other humans about, I put it in my phone. Here are some of those things. So you know how in chick flick movies there's always that one scene where the guy and the girl go to a store, the guy sits in a chair and watches as the girl puts on like a fashion show for him and like twirls around like thousands of different outfits and he's like nodding at it or saying no and stuff. Like that's in so many movies. I'm just sitting here thinking, okay, this is not realistic because guys hate shopping, especially with women. They would not be sitting there in a chair watching her, they'd be sitting in the chair outside eating pretzels and cheese. Two, a guy would not be shaking his head yes or no to outfits because he couldn't care less about outfits. And lastly, if the guy is paying, they would not be in a designer store. They'd be in like Walmart or Goodwill. Let me tell you a little something about self-control and willpower with food. <laughs> I have none. Someone in my house bought ice cream. I don't buy ice cream because if I do, I will eat it all within two minutes. I'm not joking. So I find some ice cream. This ice cream isn't even mine. My self-control, guys. Wow. I was having a bad day and so I wanted to make a bowl of ice cream and I did. 30 seconds later I decided I need a refill. If someone was there watching this they would have been very confused because I spent at least 5 minutes with the bowl sitting on the counter and me just staring at it. Finally I forced myself to wash the bowl out in the sink so I wouldn't get any more. I just wondered if anyone else has the same problem because like, I love ice cream. I love food hungry right now. Why do people bag into parking spaces? God! It's making me worked up thinking about this. We people say it's a time saver. What time are you saving? You were spending 20 extra seconds pulling up in front of the parking spot and carefully backing into it than it would be to just pull it normally and then when you leave just pull out and go. Like it's not hard to back out of a parking spot whenever you're leaving. It's not that big of a deal to where you need to back into the parking spot when you get there. What makes me really mad? Why would you back into a parking spot in an empty parking lot? I want to leave them a note on their car that just says, why did you do that? And that's it, just why. Okay, toilet paper crumbling versus folding. People always think if you fold your toilet paper, then you have your shit together. And people who crumple up their toilet paper to wipe are slobs, but nay. It is the opposite. If you crumple up your toilet paper, then that means you most likely had it on the toilet paper holder dispenser thingy. That means that you're good at changing out toilet paper rolls, which means you are diligent and trustworthy. Toilet paper folders most likely do this. People say that they wipe with folded toilet paper. I was thinking that they pulled out the toilet paper and folded it like this and I was like why would you even do that that's so time consuming but I know your secret and you are not fooling me and I'm gonna tell your secret to the world get your life I know those were just a few pitiful thoughts but I just wanted to make a video sorry if I disappointed you if you like this video or agree with something or disagree with something or want to talk to me about something leave a comment down below okay and be sure to like and subscribe especially subscribe like tell other people to subscribe because I'm kind of you know what I mean? I think we're done here.